Well, hey folks, first day back after uh, a while for Abby. Of course, don't forget the injury we had. She got shot. Part of her lung is now missing on the left side, so it is unfortunately one of those uh, kind of, yeah, situations. Bit of extended rehab, but she is back and we are back on the road again. Put these things in the car. go. Is that Josh? I think it is Josh. Huh. I think he just got on shift. We'll find out. Just time for the day? Hello there. You just get on shift? Hey, yep, just signing on. Yeah, me too. It's been a minute, but uh, excited to get back out there. Hopefully, at least. <laughs> what had you out? Oh, uh, officer involved shooting. Uh, <laughs> officer was involved, and I got shot. Ah. Yep. It's been a really long climb back, but I'm back at least, so I'm happy. Uh, Taylor. I don't recognize this character. Pleasure to meet you. Baker. Baker, nice to meet you. Ah, I'll stay safe out there. <laughs> it is not a nice day. You I'm too, discovered. glad to have you back. Yeah, me too. Yeah, keep it easy on your first day. Uh huh, I don't plan to go running after anybody at least. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, we're going to get back out there and get on the road and we're going to see what comes our way. Who knows? It could be fun, it could be total chaos. But I'm, I'm hoping for good at least. That would be ideal, I suppose. No, not the ambulance, the car. And everyone's in a Tahoe, it seems. <laughs> oh, so we're quite a call is. Fourth, I'm going to pick up that call at uh, 3025. Did I attach myself? I did. So that's just the. Uh, store down the end of the road and shouldn't be too far for us so I guess this is our first call of the day we'll find out what we're gonna get female with a backpack Sheriff, show me route 320 Toledo Boulevard from the sheriff's office no oh, yeah CPS call definitely suits Can Josh down to the ground that's green for going straight through not green for turning right so it's always a confusing junction that one you're never quite sure what you're going to get. And that's still green. Come on, come on. Let me go through. It's amber. That means hurry up and get through the junction, obviously. So a female with a backpack stole a bunch of items. So shoplifting is our first call of the day. That can't go too wrong for Abby. I'm going to totally jinx myself now. But hey, you, you like to try, don't you? Gorgeous early morning here in Polito. I love the sun sunrise and sunset in this game. It really does just Probably blow me away. Come on, get through here before this changes, please. Again, another amber. I'm cutting it fine today. Don's Country Store. 4-3, show me on scene. Hi, Deputy Taylor with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. I believe you had some shoplifting this Hi. morning. I'm sorry, what was that? I said I believe you had some shoplifting this morning. Do you want to tell me about that? I'm sorry, hold on. I've got people in my ears. Yeah. So I heard you had a shoplifter. Okay. Yep, yeah, sorry. Um, yeah, some okay. girl came in and stole a bunch of stuff. Okay, can you describe it for me? And what was it she took? Uh... Uh, it was a white female in a black sleeveless hoodie, had a backpack on. Um, she took a couple bottles of alcohol, um, packs of cigarettes, and some magazines. Okay, she managed to get all that stuff right by the counter. Were you in the back room or something? <laughs> yeah. 
So cigarettes, uh, alcohol, and what was it? Uh, some magazines. Okay, and sounds like a teenager going for a party. Um, you said white female, black sleeveless hoodie. What was the hair colour? Any defining features? Uh, I was brunette. Brunette. Anything interesting about her or unusual? Uh, I mean, I guess she had, like, glasses. She had glasses. Okay. And then red contacts. And contacts. Okay. Uh, was her hair up or down mm -hmm. or...? Hair was up in a bun. Okay. And do you remember what her shoes were at all? Or via pants? Channel, then one call back. Sorry, what was that? Do you remember her shoes or pants? We'll find out, I guess. Um, might have been like brown or beige or khaki. Some one of those kind of color pants. Okay. All right. Um, give me a call if anybody comes back this way that uh, you recognize and or anything comes to mind. Um, it's my car. Okay. I'm gonna get out there and take a look around. There's some spots that teens like to hang around up here in Polito, so I'll go check those out first. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you. Hope you have a better day. Yep. Okay, let's get a bolo placed on this one. White female, black sleeveless hoodie, brunette, hair up in bun, contacts, asses, and pants wanted in connection. Three six one tango traffic stop ending eight five seven clear. Four four three. Yeah, that'll do. Right, I'm gonna go check out some spots and see if we can find this one. Well look at what just ran past me. Miss Miss Hey Miss Hi. Hello. How's it going? Hi. Doing good. Doing good, huh? You've been shopping this morning? Uh, no. No? Okay. No. Um. So, funny story. And you'll hear me for a second, right? Uh, girl matching your description, almost to a T, was seen by the clerk at the Don's Country Store at the road, taking some alcohol magazines and cigarettes from behind the counter when she wasn't there. Does that strike any memories? No. No? Okay, so if I was to ask you to open the backpack, I wouldn't find any of those things, would I? No. Okay, so why don't you hand the backpack over to me and let me take a look. Hmm? Car 1278. 278. Okay. Are we able to get you down here to the uh, dirt road? I, uh, Under here, please. You are being detained right now, okay? You do match the description of someone who is reported station. committing the crime, so you're not free to leave. Uh, okay. Your job. Turn Ten the back over. For fishing. It's, uh, okay. Just... Hold on a second. Let's see what's in this bag. She just literally ran past me. I was down here a minute ago checking it. Came back to my car. Got in my car. It's just someone called in saying that there's this woman that's suspicious and she's fishing. What's the suspicious of someone fishing? 10, we're all being around. There you go. Okay, let's have a look in here. Interesting eyes you've got. That's a distinct yeah, feature. Yeah, I figured. You know, it's funny, the woman behind the counter said that the girl who did it also had glasses and red contacts. What are the chances of that in Polito Bay, huh? Why don't you be honest with me, because it's going to be a lot easier if you are. Let's see what's in this bag. Ah, what's in here? Oh, look. Beer. Newspaper, magazine, and cigarette packs. Okay, do me a favor and turn around for me, okay? Come on, come here. Turn around.
Whoa! 4-3 foot pursuit, Copio Drive, Pluto Bay, heading back onto the main road. Uh, white female, dark hair, grey hoodie, tan pants. Heading westbound for Copio Drive. Stop running, it's just gonna get harder, okay? Huh. Huh. Come here! Stop running, crossing into houses. I'm crossing uh, through towards the supermarket. Come on, please stop running. My friends are coming, they're looking to make it. Wait. I'm gonna go to Pluto Boulevard. And in between shops by the Bay Hardware. Stop running! Over the fence. Stop running! Come on. Stop running. Stay here. Okay? What are you at? Behind the Bay Hardware. Turn around. Turn around. Now! I will not ask you again. Turn around or you will be tased. Do it. Come on. Turn around. Fine. Face the wall. <sighs> Do not move, That's okay? Good. Yep. What did I say about not chasing people? <laughs> yeah. I said that too until she took All off right. me. Uh, can you take yeah, a second? I'll, I'll bring my car around. Just stay here, okay? Yeah, okay. Good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go get the car. Okay. Okay, ignore that. Uh, my brain came in and out of existence for a second. Yeah, that's fine. I didn't see anything. Gotta train more. Gotta train more to run. Yeah, no kidding. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you do say will be used against you in a court of law. You have to head to an attorney if you cannot afford one. I'll be provided for you. Yes, and right this moment to you. Yep. Okay, good. And the reason why I'm so out of breath is I'm just back from surgery. It's my first day, and you made me oh. run, okay? Oh. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, I didn't want to get into a foot chase today. I'm going to search you. Anything on you? I need to know about? Uh, uh, other than I think uh, my wallet and my phone. Okay. Uh, I don't really think so. <sighs> That's here you can. Here you can. Okay, my current, my current Mr. Call. Okay. Call. 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 Oh god. Oh. Okay. I need a whole three blocks. Uh, Do you need a, a proper bag? No, yeah, yeah, please. Huh. Oh god. I did All not right. think that kicked my ass so hard. Bags for her stuff and a water bottle for you, ma'am. Thank you. Up in fences, it's not even nine o'clock in the morning yet. Oh. <laughs> I wanted some nice boring traffic stops. <sighs> nice. That truck is broken. So very broken. I had a runaway 17 year old and you had a, oh. a literal runaway. So. Yeah, quite literally. We're both were doing our jobs. Uh -huh. <laughs> Where are you parked at? Uh, Procopio Drive by the turn in towards the steps down to the cove. Alright. Uh, no. Uh, you know how I said I was back from surgery? Well. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I lost a small portion of my left lung, the lower lobe. Or part of it, ah, at least. So. Yeah, took a round in there a couple of weeks ago, and I've been rehabbing. I passed my fitness test, <laughs> but apparently the fitness test at the uh, academy does not equate to hopping fences chasing after an actual person, and I wish they knew that. <sighs> and you were about stitches popping out? Uh, no, the stitches came out a while ago. <sighs> okay, good. All right, I can transport her since she's already in my car. Okay, so. thank you. I'll meet at the station, okay? You good? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll see you at the station. All right. Yeah. Uh, right. Okay, we're back at the station. I've caught my breath now. Right, face the wall. All right. Okay. Face the wall to the right. Cabinet. Oh wow. Well. Close enough. All right, now step inside the tunnel. Okay. Ah. <sighs> 
<sighs> yep, come back in. Uh, these are your cuffs. Yeah, they are. Well, yeah, they're definitely not, not mine, so. Alright. What's, what, what's wrong with them? They're just cuffs. 161 Foxtrot, you know, on scene Redwood. Alright, here you go. Uh, Thank you. Uh, do we have eyes on victims or not? You good here? Uh, yep, should be good. Uh, not located anybody yet. All Thank right. you very much. Perfect. Appreciate the help a lot. No problem. Thanks. Stay safe. Okay, CR 132620. Uh, 9326. A couple of priors were similar. So. I'm going to give her two things, Petty Theft Citation and Resisting. 161 Foxtrot, arriving on scene. That's that taken care of. Let's do the citation here. One to zero, clear off last tonight. It would be uh, petty theft. It's beer, cigarettes, and magazines. It's not that over three four hundred dollars. Six and six one Mike Offcom. Okay, Miss Blake. So today you're yeah. being uh, charged with uh, resisting a peace officer because I'm feeling petty. You made me run on my first day. And also a citation here for petty theft for the items you took from the 24 7, okay? Okay. You've got a so reason why I'm actually citing you for. You for... And petty theft. Well, the resisting reason why I was, again, I was, I'm partially joking about feeling petty, but you did make me run on my first day. But uh, the main reason is you have got priors for I this sort of thing. I'm completely out of shape, too. Don't worry about it. Well, you have priors for theft and for resisting, so unfortunately, I had to give you the arrest for this regard because. Again, first strike is out the door already, okay? Perhaps try and do different things, because stealing things and running from cops is not going to be a good path for you, okay? Okay. Alright, David from County will come and take you now, okay? Yep. And boom, off she goes. I'm going to go take these items back to 24-7, and I will see you guys back on the road. One six one Fox shot, unit turn back around, I got eyes on them. Oh, that's a resisting suspect. Not my problem. I'm going on the side of the road. Huh. I think he was drifting across the road. I can't tell. Where did he go? No. Oh. 403, show me traffic stop at the uh, Palace Springs tramway. Black four door sedan, occupied times one, no additionals. I can't get the plates on this thing. But it has got a plate. Just can't see it. Now I need to make the call in the CAD real quick. Uh, transporting one high priority to create this. We are at 3003. 3003. Traffic stop. Four door. Sign myself to the call. Benefit the doubt. Here she has got a plate. Hi, sir. Do you want to turn the engine off for me? Hello, sir. Oh, well, why do I need to turn off the vehicle? Just so oh, I, I can talk to, talk to you. Vehicle. I was quite loud. Got the license, registration, proof, insurance. Possible drugs. Yeah, yeah, I got a blood box. Okay, just go for that for me, please. Uh, Any weapons in the car or anything I need to go about, sir? Nope. Oh. Okay. The rear plate seems to be damaged. Have you got a plate for this vehicle in the front? Hey. 
Uh, uh -huh. No, put it away. Four, three. Put it away. Put it, down. put it away. No, put it away. Drop the gun. Drop, please drop the gun. I don't want to have to shoot you. Drop the gun. I don't want to shoot you. Drop the gun. Drop it now. Drop your gun. Drop, no, drop the gun now. Drop your gun. Shit. Drop it. Drop it. Drop yours. Shit. Duh. She can't. She's just come back from being shot, so. Fuck. Fuck. Ugh. Look, I'm not gonna do anything, okay? Just. Leave me alone, please. Please. Toss me your cuffs on your, uh. To toss me your cuffs on your belt. Please don't shoot Turn me, around. please. Please don't. I was shot recently. Please do not shoot me. Please. Please. I, I'm not going to shoot you. I'm not going to shoot you. <sighs> oh, fuck. Fuck. Uh, did you already go on your... I called the stop in, but that's it. Nothing else, okay? I promise. Why do I always get kidnapped? Oh, it's got my radio no, now. This is good stuff. I don't need you calling your friends, okay? Yes. Yes. Idea. That door, the back door on that, am I yes. able to open? Yeah, yes, it should be. It's not locked. What is he going to do to me? I'm going to put you in the back of here, okay? Yes. Okay. Well, right now we put it in the back of my own car. A good start. Alright, I'm gonna leave you here, okay? I'm gonna I'm gonna go on my way. <sighs> Shit. Uh I have no door handles on the inside oh, of the back of this oh, car. Fuck. I am kinda oh, stuck in here. Duh, why me? I could put, there's a witness literally right there watching. I could put a call in. I mean, literally, he's a witness right there. That's the perfect witness. She's going out to lay this if I have additional. 241, I'm uh, um, going to be a mile out. Wanted down from Polito and Procopio. Can't even get to my radio. I'm literally kind of screwed in here. I'm route one, I was driving down. Literally kind of screwed. I wouldn't even have that right now, would I? God damn it! I didn't want to actually shoot him or take cover over firefight because coming back from being shot up is not exactly the right frame of mind. The thought of shooting somebody or getting shot kind of fucked her up and froze her. So I figured I'd play this one differently rather than getting into a shootout because people try and kidnap me all the time. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to play terrified for once because cops never do that. It's definitely turned interesting, that's for sure.
Oh boy. It's gonna find me in the back of my own car, handcuffed. Taylor, all right. Is the car unlocked? Uh, yes. There you go. Your uh, hands, my hands. Uh, hey. the Hispanic male. Yep, yep. What kind of vehicle? Black ponytail. Uh, black Impala. Broken rear window until light. All right. He took my radio and my gun. All right. So he was gonna shoot me. I. <laughs> see, I've got Taylor here. She advised Hotel Mike in a black Impala oh. with a broken back windshield. What direction did it go? Uh, it's, uh, that way, towards town. Towards town? Towards Polito? Yeah, th th that way on, the, on Procopio. He went uh, east on Procopio. Okay, alright. <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ. <sighs> Vehicle was last seen heading northbound from 3003 on Procopio Jesus Promenade. Jesus fucking Christ. Hey, you good? Uh, I thought he was going to shoot me. I thought I was dead. I thought I was hey, straight you're dead. you're okay. Just take a breath. Just take a breath, okay? You're fine. I thought he was going to kill me. Right. He, he, he had... Just um, take a breath from me, okay? It was maybe something, was something covered on the passenger seat. It looked like possibly drugs. I was getting his ID. He pulled a Glock on okay. me. I didn't have the time. I drew my gun, but I couldn't shoot him. Hey, hey, I hey, couldn't move. Out, okay? I couldn't... You go anywhere, you I just alive. froze that. Hey. It just Taylor, froze up, breath, I'm sorry. Okay? Taylor, take uh, a breath. You made it out alive, that's the most yeah. important thing, okay? I just, take a breath. Uh, um, he had a... Don't, um, don't worry about it. He had a rose tattoo on his left arm. Um, black and red tattoo on the left side of his neck. Uh, he had a black hair and a short ponytail. Um, tank top, jeans. Uh, black tank top, blue jeans. Um, Impala plate started in 86, but the plate was damaged, you couldn't see the middle of it. Uh, one tail light out left hand side, rear window was broken. Um, black Chevrolet Impala, late, uh, later model. Oh, I remember everything clearly, but I just couldn't right. do anything when he pulled the gun. Yep. Hey, hey, it's okay. Alright, let's get you over in my cruiser and we'll head to the yes. station, okay? Yes, I'm right. sorry. I no, you're fine. You're fine. Did so he take your gonna... keys or are your keys in your vehicle? I don't know. I, I don't know what he did with them. They were in the vehicle when okay. I left them. Alright. You good to walk? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm fine to walk. I'm sorry. Okay. I right. just... My radio's over there. Yeah, I see it. Okay. Let's go get you in the side of the vehicle first. Yes, sir. And then we'll go from there, okay? I'll get yeah. your radio. Oh, God. What a day this is. <laughs> First day back. I and couldn't not a great do anything. One. I'm right. sorry. I just... I, I hey, feel like an hey, idiot. Hey, it's fine. It, it's fine. I saw the gun and you I just... Out That's... Didn't know what to do. I just froze up. You didn't get shot. That's the most important thing. <sighs> Only by pure luck. He had me at gunpoint on my knees. And you got out alive. That's the most important thing. <sighs> I guess. Turn the radio on the B1 in Josh's car. 171, 110. Go for it. Go for it. Do we have a tag? Stand by. Stand by. My lights will be on. My lights are on. The, the camera will be running. Okay. Yeah. Let me check the tag. Did you run the tag at all? I couldn't. I was trying to get it off him because okay, the plate was, was damaged. It was obstructed. Gotcha. Uh, four three. Plate, I believe, started in eighty six. Plate was damaged. I was in the process of gathering the rest of that information at the time. Um, damaged rear plate, beginning eighty six, I think. Uh, left tail light out. Rear window broken. Black Impala, like a nineties model. Um, Hispanic male, black hair, short ponytail, rose tattoo on left arm, red and black tattoo on left side of neck, black tank top, blue jeans. 
Or 63, that too. Iron Fear Plaza, be on the lookout for a black, black Impala, Impala with, the with the San Andreas tag, tag of 63 Whiskey Alpha Sierra 810. 63 Whiskey Alpha Sierra 810. That's close. How you doing, Oof? Great, I couldn't even remember the part of the plate I could see. Hey, can you run that plate on my computer? Yes, yes, sorry. No, you're fine. Up to there, can I get County Fleet to 3003 for copy of promenade? 810. Alright, look up the retro owner. Comes on back that. to Martino Santiago. Uh, long record violent. Yeah, look up his uh, mugshot. Let's see if that matches our guy. Sorry, I'm be a little behind you. I think the drug and weapon charges. This matches him, and yeah, that's that's him. That's the man. Okay. Um, is armed and dangerous and known violent path. Hey, look, um, I'm gonna ask you something silly right now, but I need to go up in the station and get myself another handgun and a radio, but I want to see this through, otherwise I'm not gonna get back out on the road. Can I ride with you? Okay. Yeah. Please, I need to finish this or I'm not gonna be able to no, do yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Passing the U-20 on I won't be a second. Yeah. She's gonna get back out there. She froze up, but she needs to go and finish this. One seventy one, two seventy. Go. We can try something on the ramp. Yeah, we're getting off the ramp now. Joshua. Okay, I'm good. <sighs> I'm not tired At least I hope I will be. <sighs> It'll be fine. I'm ready to go. on you right now. He might be running for me, actually. Stand by. Is it Joshua southbound, it. southbound past you two? Yep. Before we advise, subject has history of drug possession, firearms violence. Martinez Santiago. Yeah, Tampa is running from us, secondary take call. We're going to be north to Panorama, uh, Black and Color 41, call us 63 with a map of Sam 810. Going to be East Joshua. East Joshua towards CP at this point. Alright, we're going to set up at the tunnel. Three close to north Panorama. Yes. Go ahead and pass me. He's going to keep making these short turns. Or Buffalo Hammer. Yeah. 171, secondary, or continuing, Vesta Hammer. South Panorama. Approaching 10 and 20. Hopefully, we'll catch this guy. I want to be there when he does. Continuing, South Panorama, passing 10 20. I don't think I'd be able to go back on the road again if she didn't complete this. Probably about 10. Well, we got two vehicles on it right now. From Sandy towards Smoke Tree, they're heading south. Yeah. Right on to South Catla, into the junkyard. Keep and south on here. Yeah, I'm get, we're gonna go and cover the back perimeter. Yeah. Got in hand, right hand. 71, tank code on scene, black, T, black, red, blue jeans. 14, 110, we're going to be coming down to 13, we'll get the rear. Hang on in his right hand. White male, white tank top, black jeans. Not white. Very much not white, Hobbit but... 
We'll be on game in 10 seconds. 361 shots fired. Officer down. Shit. Come on. Coming up there now. Stop here. Okay. Yeah. I'm ready, I promise. Let's break down. Got suspect down. All right. Let's yeah. Head up. Here's we have suspect down. Nine five four route sixty eight near the uh, power plant thing. That's around the corner. Might as well go back to the car. Uh, yeah, I'm grabbing my car. Yeah. Suspect in custody. One six one Fox Shark. There's a med club. Come on, stupid sand. Pity I couldn't be there when he got shot. I can't believe another officer got hit though. Game's on scene, clear for medical. Hey, Med 50, you're on scene. Over here. 171, just tonight. They just Zerg rush him, I think. I do need a bag. 171, where are you at? Yeah. That's him. He's south of the wall. Um, Panorama. To the back? Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see you. To your right. I don't think Percy vs. Garner covers okay. a field. Boy, GWs. No second. <sighs> yep, I'm packing them. Yeah, I'm packing them. Yeah, I'm packing them. One fox shot. Down officer inside or outside the wall. Outside. I don't know what to say. Like? Uh, four gunshots to the back. Did you search him yet or no? Yeah, I shot him in the back because yeah, he just hopped that wall after shooting the cop and then yeah. started running towards active okay. traffic the with the gun in his hand. If you want to search him. Ah, uh, it's not my fault. It shouldn't have gotten to this. Hey, don't blame yourself. At least you didn't get shot. I had him at gunpoint. I couldn't pull the trigger. I couldn't do anything. I just stood there like an idiot holding a gun and then I lost my nerve and I put it down. And the asshole locked me in the back of my own truck. What a cop I am, huh? Now my own cowardice has got another cop shot and him shot. It's not the return I expected. Yeah. Hopped in with uh, 110 to come down here and see this thing through, and otherwise, I don't think I would have been able to get back out there. Not again. We got here too late. By the time we got level with the place, he was already out here. <laughs> yeah, I was going about 80 down uh, the dirt part of the Cat Claw or Nowhere Road, wherever that's called. Get up here to the corner, see him jump the wall after just shooting an officer. Gun still on his hand, Who got started hit? running towards active traffic in the freeway. I don't know, I wasn't on scene. I just rolled up to see him run with the gun and shot him. 4 3, what was the officer that was hit? Copy. Shit. Another deputy. Do we have a uninvolved supervisor in the shooting? Come on, we're all right here. We're by a cat spot when you went 954. God, yeah, so you need my to go fault. Speak to him. Yeah. If you need a ride, hop in. No, I'm okay. Not the first day back she wanted. But this has definitely turned the roleplay around in its head. Normally everyone thinks super duper violence and shootings and crazy crazy, but... 
this time I didn't shoot anybody, this time I couldn't shoot anybody, and this time it changed things. Funny that. It's when you don't zerg and super ninja shoot, and also you don't always have to shoot. Things can be different because cops are humans too. Guess what, in real life, not a video game, people don't want to start blasting. They don't want to start shooting and just take everyone out because that's boring. No, 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 not boring, sorry. You don't want to shoot people in real life because guess what? It's a human life. Human lives matter. People don't want to shoot people. Especially good people, you know, cops, in this case. So yeah, guess what? Considering she's back from a shooting where she nearly died and her first day back, got a gun pulled on her. She couldn't fire. She couldn't do anything. My big thing about Abby is that she's always been human. She's not perfect. And, well, in this case, that humanity bit her in the ass. I just hope that 174 can pull through with this one. If you watch this, Andy, I'm sorry. I know what it wouldn't have happened if Abby could have shot him, but I just couldn't do it. Didn't feel right at the time. I told myself before this patrol that if I got into any sort of violent situation, I wouldn't be able to pull the trigger. Her first day back, trauma. But I thought, you know what? She's hidden things from the shrinks. If I got into something violent, this patrol, I said I would not pull the trigger. So this is what happens when I follow through on my decisions. I personally okay. do feel if I wouldn't have took those shots, you would have been able to steal our vehicle and cause even more harm to us. Or Sergeant. And even knows what he would have done to the person yeah. he's trying to steal a vehicle from. Is the officer okay? Okay. Uh, we're gonna call them up now and find out. Uh, uh, right now they're shooting him. Okay. Did you use your pistol or a rifle? Yeah, my handgun. I handgun? shot either 11 or That's 10 pounds. Like... Alright, I'll. Hey. Do they know if the officer's okay hey. or not? Sorry? Do they know if they're okay? 174? Uh, they're staying for now, they're transporting. Okay, okay, good. <sighs> you good? Yeah, no, I, I should be, I just... <laughs> I don't know if I was ready for this day, or... This right, is meant no to one's happen. really ever ready for it, so... Yeah, but I feel responsible for them now. I got them shot. I... If anything happens to them, that's on them. On me. You know? And now it's on them. It's on the person who decided to do this. That's all on them, not on yeah, you. but it was my job not to on... stop them. And I didn't. Yeah, but we can't be everywhere at once and we can't do... Even if we do but everything in our power, there. sometimes the world is against us. Sometimes the world <sighs> is against us and not everything works out is at our advantage. Yeah, I'll be thinking about this one for a while. Make you better off support. Sergeant. Hey, sir. I was going over your check on her. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. I'm a failure at this, and I. I don't know. Handed my damn badge or something. No, don't do that. I know the sheriff's going to want to yell at me. Oh, she loves yelling, though. I told the shrinks I was fine. I told yeah, the doctors she, I was fine. Yeah. Apparently, I'm neither. You had a gun pointed at you. You you, you lived. That's the important part. He had the drop on me. You My body camera was running. I've got the footage. I'll hand it over when I need to. But yeah. he pulled the gun in the car, and before, by the time I could see it, it was already pointing at me out the window, and he just got out the car with it still raised. And I had drawn mine, but I just... I, I couldn't do anything. I couldn't take cover. I couldn't shoot back. I I just stood there like an idiot. And then I gave up my own gun. Do you have any officer that can pick up the suspect at Sandy Shores and bring him over to himself? Just lucky he didn't shoot me. Then far, I'll be in uh, momentarily. Miss, do you mind staying with her? Yeah, she can ride with me. I can right. make sure she gets out of here safe. Yeah, I'll go back to station and do the paperwork. I just... I needed to come back out on the road after 
that happened yeah. and see this to the end just to know I did. I don't think I could live with myself if I didn't. You guys no, good? Don't be too hard on yourself. Yeah, yeah we're so... all Alright. Been see if right. I needed a ride, but I guess not. Uh, uh with him. Alright. He's gonna be fine by the way. Oh thank god. Alright. <sighs> On a hell of a first day. What was that? On a hell of a first day back. Chased some crazy shoplifter three blocks across Palito Bay, hopping every fence you could find, and sit there coughing my lungs up and not be able to breathe like some fat person. And then get a gun pulled on me and I freeze up like a complete rookie. Yeah, well, there's a difference when the gun's pointed at your face and they're reaching for it. Yeah. If he had the drop on you, there's no telling what could have happened if you did try to shoot him. I I don't know why, but I wasn't thinking anything at the time. I just panicked. I just my mind blocked, and I just stood there. I had enough mo muscle memory to pull the, my own gun and point it at him and tell him to drop the gun, and he told me to drop the gun, and we just back and forth until I just panicked and dropped mine. Put my dad's hands up. Begged him not to shoot me. <laughs> Some cop I am, right? Don't be too hard on yourself. Everyone reacts differently, and you were out for a good bit, so you're not used to stuff like that. High stress situations. Yeah. This one's gonna take some explaining. Well, wow. hopefully you enjoyed that. We had a couple of different calls, two technically, and uh, it's definitely been an experience coming back. Thanks, Sergeant. I need to go and write this crap up now. All right. Yeah, you're on there while you're brushing head. Yeah. Yeah, no problem. Well, hopefully you enjoyed it. Abby's first day back was most definitely eventful. Uh, suspect did have an huh. ID on him. See you later, uh, guys. Uh, 379 took it. I believe he logged it into evidence. I did not grab that. Perfect. He also Bye. did have the Glock on him with two extra mags. It's quiet now. Bye.